I lost my faith. Okay, there. I said it. I have been absolutely terrified to say that out loud online. Except for with a very few people whom I trust explicitly. So there is only a handful of people that even know that about me. But it happened about, I would say, almost a year ago. I just, it didn't start out as me losing my faith. It started out as me asking a simple question, which was, why? I was at a friend's house. We were chatting, and she was watching TV while we were chatting. And on the TV, they were showing, you know, the war, the destruction, and they were talking about death and suffering and and my friend, who is one of the most faithful people I know, strongest Christian I think I've ever met, just made a passing comment. And it was something along the lines of, oh, but there will be so much more suffering. And in that moment, now I'm 53 now. I was 52, <clears throat> excuse me, I was 52 when this moment took place. Okay. And in all of my 52 years, I had never stopped and asked. I had never thought to ask. When she said, oh, but there will be so much more suffering, or something like that, my brain, for the first time in my life, went, why? I didn't say that out loud. It was just in my head. For the first time in my life, I actually asked, or even thought to ask, why? Okay, that was the moment that this journey started. And I thought it was a simple question. I thought it was a simple question. Okay, that was my mistake. And my other mistake was not asking that question before. Okay, I was raised in a Christian family, born and raised of the Christian faith, believed what I was told, and never thought to stop and ask. And I've read the Bible. I read some as I was growing up, but as an adult, I've read it cover to cover one time. And it never dawned on me to stop and ask. I just blindly believed but in that moment of, why, my eyes started to be opened. And I couldn't believe that not only was that not a simple question, but no one could answer it, at least not to my satisfaction. So I was confused. I was frustrated. And the more... I looked into it. The more I searched, the more I hunted, the more people I talked to, the more frustrating it got and the more frustrating or the more frustrated I got. <clears throat> it just, it was <clears throat> excuse me, it wasn't as simple as I thought it was going to be, or at least not as simple as I thought it should be. Because a single question, one word, why no one could answer it or like i said at least not to my satisfaction you always have those those um in a christian based faith they you always have cop out answers that's what i call them um it's all part of god's plan you have to have faith that it'll work out in the end okay to me that doesn't answer the question it's not an answer Okay, because if it's part of his plan, if he has a reason, he needs to be more open about it. I don't know, but if I'm going to suffer, I need to know why I'm suffering. And I pretty well feel like most people would feel that way. But everybody just takes it for what they've been taught it is, which is, that's the way God wants it. That's all part of God's plan. 
God works in mysterious ways. Okay, well, he needs to stop being so mysterious because it makes no sense. Now, I do have a lot of questions, and that first one has never been answered. But I'm hoping to get to do more videos like this, where I can ask questions, tell you my thoughts, and hopefully there are people out there that can't answer the questions without using what I call the cop-out answers uh, that could explain things to me because after a year of searching and hunting and talking to people and, and losing my ever-loving mind, um, I have just completely lost my faith, which, you know, it didn't take the whole year. I lost it way back. As a matter of fact, shortly after I started asking the question, why? I just completely lost my faith when I realized nobody can answer this because, in my opinion, there isn't an actual answer. There is not an actual answer. So, hopefully, I can talk to people that can help me make sense of this because right now, in my mind... Just having faith is not cutting it. it. It's not an answer. It's not the way things should be, in my opinion. So, hopefully this doesn't scare the shit out of people that know me, that follow me online. Uh, and hopefully they don't go running screaming the other way. Uh, I've just, I lost my faith. And I need to find answers and I can't find them myself so I'm reaching out because I'm hoping that there are people out there that have gone through this that can help me understand more than what I understand now.